morning everybody and welcome back to my channel it is wednesday today i'm just out on my walk I'm trying to do this on every day that it's really nice outside and today is a absolutely beautiful fall day so getting my little walk in i love to go on this walk it's like six kilometers in total and it's just so nice, especially in this weather. It's like not too hot, not too cold. Perfect weather to go on a walk. I'm just wearing this sweater from Ritzia, a vest, some leggings from Gymshark, and my favorite walking sneakers. They're by, um, oh my God, why can't I remember now? The North Face, I think. Are they? Yeah. They're by the North Face and they're just like a really, really amazing walking sneaker. They're actually a trail running sneaker technically, but I find them perfect for walks. Like they are so comfortable on my feet, no blisters. They have like this rounded bottom to them that makes it so easy to walk in them. And I just literally love them. So yeah, just going on my walk, get some steps in. Aiden's still at my apartment chilling and probably gonna go back there and shower and kind of like figure out the rest of my day and what I want to do today. I feel like I need to go run some more errands because I feel like I have no toilet paper. <laughs> All right guys, I'm on the move again because I'm going to the grocery store. Aiden, say hi. He's making pass. <laughs> What up? <laughs> but I'm heading to the grocery store. I just need a couple of things. We don't have any paper towel, barely, toilet paper. Um, I need a new Brita filter, all of that stuff. And then excitingly, later, I'm going to look at a puppy, which I'm really excited about. It's a little corgi girl. And, you know, it could be the one. She could be the one, so we'll see. But I'm really excited. You guys know how much I've been wanting a dog recently so and yeah she's adorable so we'll see about that what happens keep you guys tuned in but let's go to the grocery store and get the goods bye honey okay struggling open yeah <laughs> that is a shit can opener so it's pretty it's pretty crap <laughs> beyond gravel beyond all Okay, so we're off now to go and see the little cute angel puppy. I'm so excited. Um, I don't think I'm gonna like vlog too much. Obviously when we're like meeting the dogs, that'd be really awkward. I did tell the people that I was a YouTuber, but you know, it's a little next level if I have to start vlogging the whole experience. But if it goes well, when I see you guys next, I will have a puppy. If it doesn't go well, I will not have a puppy. So stay tuned <laughs> to find out <laughs> what happens next. <laughs> this is my new friend. This is Millie. Millie, are you gonna be the best girl ever? I think you are. I think you are. She's like, what is this camera? But she's honestly like, already, I feel like camera ready all the time. If I pull up my phone, she just sits there and stares at it in perfect form. <laughs> You're so good. Ready? Come here, Millie. Come, Millie, come. She doesn't know about the camera. Look at her, she's like, what is that? Will they sit? Oh, that's good, camera. yes. That's so good. This is camera, you're gonna have to get used to it because you have YouTuber for mommy. <laughs> but yeah, her name is Millie. She is so cute, very feisty already. We're gonna be teaching you to be a good girl all the time, aren't we? Yes, we are. And you're gonna be a little angel princess. And hopefully not pee too many times in my house. Good morning, everyone. It is like 7 a.m. And I'm just getting ready for my first little getting Millie out for a pee. <laughs> it's probably freezing out, so just preparing to go outside. I'm getting all my stuff on, and then I'm going to go get her out of the crate and bring her downstairs so that she won't pee on the floor. I'm going to try and start off today on a good note. I have her first pee of the day outside. Then I'm gonna come back in and feed her, make my breakfast, all that kind of stuff. So, welcome to my first full day as a puppy mom of my girl Mill, my common little sassy queen Mill. <laughs> She's so cute though. 
Oof, Millie was a good girl and went pee and poo outside, didn't you, honey? Yes, she did. But what she really needs to work on, 120%, is walking on the leash. Terrible, absolutely terrible. She literally throws temper tantrums if she doesn't get her way. <laughs> Which I've heard, uh-uh, no. I've heard that corgis are very, very strong-willed, stubborn, and so true. She thinks she knows the best way to go. And if you try and redirect her, she lays down and goes, ah, ah, and rolls around her back like it's the hardest thing to ever happen to her. But she did go pee and poo almost immediately when she was outside, so I was really happy with that. She at least knows to go to the bathroom. I mean, living in a city, she clearly doesn't mind concrete because she just went on the concrete. <laughs> You've probably been used to peeing on concrete, haven't you? Yeah. But we're gonna have breakfast and then play for a little bit, and then you gotta go out for another pee to make sure that you don't have accident, right? And then I gotta call the vet about you today, and we gotta try and get you in puppy classes. Ow! Puppy biting, man, puppy biting. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do, I guess, like a brief explanation of how I got her. I saw her, an ad for her, she was actually being like, kind of rehomed like i don't know the whole situation but she did have different owners i think they said they were fostering her and they were rehoming her basically for a breeder and i was like she is adorable so i messaged them and then they were like i think you would be perfect basically and then i met her and i just thought she was such a little fiery bundle of joy a little crazy chicken nugget that's for sure she's nuts but we're gonna have, yes, you're crazy, you're crazy. We're gonna play and have breakfast, right? Now that we know you won't have accident in the house. Now that we know you won't have accident. Let's go get a toy. All right, guys, it is 9.55 in the morning now. I've let Millie out three times and she's been so good. No accidents, well, actually that's a lie. She peed in my carpet, <laughs> but no poo-poo accidents. So that's good. And I just let her out now and she went and peed on the grass. So she's doing really good. I just booked her appointment for Sunday to get her second round of vaccines. So after that, I'll be able to take her out like a lot more because right now I've just kind of been avoiding most interactions because I do want to keep her safe and I know that she needs to get her second round of vaccinations first. So trying to keep that in mind, <laughs> but she's going on Sunday, so that'll be good. But she's being a good girl. I'm just waiting for her to get a little bit tired. I might play with her a bit more to get her pretty tired because I still need to go back to the pet store and get a couple more things for her. So I'm gonna wait till she's a bit tired, then put her in her crate, and then probably head out and get the stuff that I need from the pet store. But she's being a really good girl so far. Aren't you, Mel? You're learning so much already and be getting even better every day. I don't know what she's trying to eat currently, but there's something there that's really interesting her. What is that? Is that you? Is that Millie? Is that Millie? Is that Millie? She sees herself in the reflection. Is that Millie? <laughs> That's Millie. Guys, I just went and got some more things from her from the pet store. I did get her some stustuff last night, like emergency stuff, like her crate. Also, it's her, she's sleeping. <laughs> and some other stuff. This crate actually doesn't fit her. I need to get her a bigger one but it was the only one they had. So she's gonna definitely outgrow this soon. But for right now, it's okay. She's able to lay down, so she's still comfy in there. But I got her some stuff. So I got her this collar by Wolf Concept. She obviously is still growing, so I wanna wait till she's fully grown to get her like her good stuff that I'm gonna spend like good money on. But I picked her up this little donut collar, so cute. I got her a little name tag that says Millie, which is super cute. And then I picked up some toys and whatnot. I got her a new harness because hers seemed a little bit small to me. Either way, she'll grow into this one if the other one is, this one's too big, but hers seemed really small. So I picked her up this new one. Then I got her a little slow bowl feeder, which kind of is just like a little bit of a puzzle. So it takes her a little bit longer to eat, which will be good because she does eat super fast, like inhales her food. <laughs> so I got this. Some chuck it balls. She doesn't really understand fetch yet, but we're working on it. <laughs> 
this little toy ball that I can put like treats in and she can use as a puzzle, like roll it around to get the treats out, which is good. And then I got her just a Kong with the Kong treat so that if I'm gonna leave her for a little bit, I can put a treat in there and leave it in her crate with her that, so that she looks at her crate as a good place and a place that she gets snacks and stuff. She's already very good in the crate. Shockingly, I've never had a dog this good in my life in a crate. She doesn't even cry much in there and she just kind of lays down and goes to sleep. So that's good. But yeah, got her a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna put her little thing on her collar soon because it's so cute. All right guys, it is 1.16 now. I let Millie out again. She was good. She peed and pooed outside. She's been doing so good with that. And now she's sleeping again. So I'm taking advantage of all of her naps to get work done, basically. Any editing, filming, anything I need to do, I'm like, the minute she passes out in her crate, I'm like, perfect, it's work time. <laughs> I am actually really tired though today. I didn't sleep well last night. I think I just had in my mind like all the things I need to do today. And I was just like, oh my God, I have so much I need to do about her. And I didn't sleep very well. I slept probably like four or five hours. So I'm not ideal, so I'm really tired, but I'm trying to like power through today so I can just get a really good sleep tonight and just try and sleep like through the night completely before I let her out again tomorrow. But right now I'm just looking into signing her up. Well, I'm editing this video that you're currently watching and I'm gonna look up enrolling her in puppy school in like a little puppy place in Toronto. I just wanna socialize her a lot for the most part, make sure she's around like other puppies, other dogs and has all those social skills. If any of you have any tips and you've had a puppy, on raising it, training it, anything, let me know down below in the comments. I would love any advice. She's pretty good with the crate, so that one's not that bad. I do need to work on like walking on a leash and I need to work on most like tricks. She only knows sit, so I gotta teach her everything else. <laughs> and she's very stubborn, so she's not as easy. Like when I trained Ozzy way back in the day, he was so fast to learn everything because he wasn't stubborn, he would just do it. <laughs> While she's very like, what's in it for me? Kind of situation, so a little bit harder, but we got it. I'm tired, I feel like a new mother. I feel like I just like gave birth and now I'm sleep deprived. Like, what is this? <laughs> I'm just checking in, how are you doing today? How are you liking your second day at your home? Actually, technically your first full day since we got you last night and you basically just played, pooped, and went to sleep. But you know what else you did today? You haven't pooped inside. And you only peed on the rug once. No, not the marble. And you peed the other time on the pee pad inside. So that wasn't too bad. And it was by the front door, so you kind of knew what you were doing. Slightly. Let's see if she comes after me if I leave. She seems to be pretty good with it so far. <laughs> Do I have a follower? Do I have a, who is that? Is that little Mill? Is that little Mill? With the ball? Oh. Oh. Go get it! Wow! She gets a little scared when she hits the walls. <laughs> yes, good girl, Mill. I really want to teach her to play fetch. She's kind of getting it like slowly. Like I feel like if I keep doing repetition, she's gonna understand it totally. But I do feel like, oh, we don't eat the pee pads. Oh, no. Her teeth are literally like little talons. Itch. Go get it. I'm gonna get it then. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I don't. <laughs> she's like, no, I'm over that. <laughs> her nap <laughs> I was able to take some little bit of time for myself while she was napping showered made myself look a little bit more presentable all that jazz but yeah I'm about to go let her out again she definitely probably will have to go poo poo right it's poo poo time so I'm gonna let her out but I just wanted to come on and end off today's video because I've kind of a busy night and finish editing this and all that stuff so I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed meeting Millie and you're excited for all the content with her little cute face. She's ready to go poo poo. But yeah, 
Love you guys so much, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye. Really, say bye to everyone. Say bye. Thanks for tuning in. Say bye. <laughs> Good job. Thank you.